Mike Strickland live on V95. <laughs> I sometimes, guess we finally got it on. I don't know. Well, sometimes it's easy and sometimes it's not. Tonight, sometimes the engineer is good and sometimes he's not. Is well, that what that's what he gets for drinking coffee. You know? All right. <laughs> live from V95 at the world-famous Western Steakhouse and Lounge. My sidekick and engineer, J.C. Byers, is running the show, and Mike Strickland's on the piano and vocals. Right now, let's kick it over to Mike, and Mike, you get about... Approximately 12,000 people tonight, probably less than anybody's out of town, but here's Mike Strickland. Give him a hand, we. I throw my troubles down on Madam Rue. You know that gypsy with a gold cap, too. She's got a pair down at 34th and Vine, selling little bottles of love potion number nine. Told her that I've been a flop with chicks. I've been this way since 1956. She looked at my palm and she made a magic sign. Said that what you need is love potion number nine. She bent down, she turned around, she gave me a wink. Said I'm gonna mix it up right here in the sink. It smelled like turpentine, it looked like India ink. I held my nose, I closed my eyes, I took a drink. I didn't know if it was day or night. I started kissing everything in sight. But when I kissed a cop down at 34th and Vine, he broke my little bottle of love potion number nine. A drink. I didn't know if it was day or night. I started kissing everything in sight. It felt so good that I'm going back again. I wonder what had happened with love potion number 10. Love potion number 9. Love potion number 9. Love potion number nine. Love potion number nine. Live from the Western Steakhouse, the home of the Sizzling Steaks. You're listening to Hot Country V95 out of Hernando Coldwater. And we'll be here for the next half hour, 45 minutes. Somewhere along the line. We've got some visitors tonight. I hate to mispronounce names, but, you know, I, I can't read half of it. My own writing, plus anybody else's. Danny Holmes from CIC Industrial Environmental Service. Where's Danny Holmes at? He's over there somewhere. I know. Greg Goodson from Union, a Union Electrician. Where's Greg at? All right. Uh, Tom Braxton visiting from St. Louis. He's in the rag business. What kind of business is a rag business? I heard a lot of things called rags. I don't know. Jim Poach. A geographic designer from the Pink Palace. Graphic designer from the Pink Palace. Judd C. He's a Pink Palace longtime patron of the Western Steakhouse. Where's Judd C. at? Is he back over there somewhere? There he is. All right. And Tommy around close. Gary and Pat Freely. He's a major with the U.S. Marines. He's from New Orleans, Louisiana. Where is he at? We've got a Marine major with us tonight. Hey, that's good. Our sheriff used to be an ex-major. Did you know that? Oh, he's in the Army, wasn't he? Peter and Michael Taylor visiting from White Plains, New York. Work in New York City, first-time visitor. Where are they at? All right. Glad to have you. You got a lot of people from the South listening to you. And you know, and, uh, we always like to have people come out of New York and come down here because they got a different language than we have. Yeah, here there's a talk, yeah. There's nothing that'll tickle the redneck quite as much as Yankee talking, okay? <laughs> oh, me. They said that Yankee men like the sound of the Yankee women, though. They got that sugar in their voice. Is that what they call it? Oh, I like women don't matter where they come from. 
Oh, you smart Alec. Your wife is watching you, too. You better say woman. That's the reason I can say that. She's here. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Back to the one and only Mike Strickland on the piano and vocals. Mike, you got one. Lay it on us. Desperado, why don't you come to your senses? You've been out riding fences for so long now. Oh, you're a hard one, but I know you got your reasons. These things that are pleasing you can hurt you somehow. Don't you draw the queen of diamonds, boy. She'll beat you if she's evil. You know the queen of hearts is always your best bet. And it seems to me some final things have been laid upon your table. But you only want the one that you can't get. Desperado. Oh, you ain't good no younger. Your pain and your hunger, they're driving you home. And freedom, oh, freedom, well, that's just some people talking. Your prison is walking through this world all alone. Don't you be the sky won't snow, the sun won't shine. It's hard to tell the nighttime from the day. You're losing all your highs and lows, and ain't it funny how the feeling goes away? Why don't you come to your senses, climb down from your fences, and open the gate? It may be raining, but I know you got a rainbow above you. You better let somebody love you. Let somebody love you. You got to let somebody love you. Yeah, before it's too late. All right. Mike Strickland on the keyboard. A.J. doing the cooking. Ms. Leo running the business. You're listening to a live broadcast from the Western Steakhouse and Lounge on WVIM Radio. We call it the Colonel. Leo Thompson Hour. Right now it's time to pay a light bill. We're going to talk about George Taggett, Cowboy Corner. Cowboy Corner is located on Goodman Road, just a little bit west of I-55 at the Horn Lake exit. Got a great big horse on top of a sign out there. He will sell you anything in this world in the line of Western wear for the cowboy, the cowgirl, or those who would like to be one or the other. Also sells tacks, saddles, bridles, blankets, horseshoes, but he don't sell horses. He's got a bulletin board in front of the store that's got a lot of horses listed on it for sale, but he don't sell them. How about alligator boots? He don't sell alligator boots either, but I can tell you how to get them. How do you get them? Well, all you got to do is, a fella told me one time, I knew he was lying, but he told me all you got to do is go to Louisiana or Florida, catch you an alligator, and get you some alligator boots. What happened when you turned them over? Man, I got down there. I wrestled an alligator for four and a half hours. I turned the sucker over his barefoot, and I still don't have no boots. <laughs> that alligator <laughs> boots. Have boots on it. <laughs> but George Taggart's got some alligator boots. Yeah, I don't. You don't have to drive near a store, and you don't have to wrestle an alligator. <laughs> now, we talk about boots. George Taggart's got everything from Texas all the way up to the high price. Tony Lamas, and even on up past that, 
And he's also got a pair of boots down there, Tommy, his tennis shoes. I never saw a pair of tennis shoes boots. Have you? Yeah, I saw my George Sackets. Yeah, I saw them out there. <laughs> and I thought it was kind of funny. That's the first time I've ever seen a pair of boots as tennis shoes. What did they use them for? That rodeo clown. Oh, a rodeo clown. Yeah, yeah, you, you can't work a rodeo without wearing boots, and you can't outrun a bull with boots on, so you got to wear tennis shoe boots. All right, that's yeah. good. George Sackett, our boy, Cowboy Corner, the one and only place to buy your cowboy clothes or your cowgirl clothes or anything in the tack business. All right, now we're live on B95, Hot Country Radio, and here is Mike Strickland. Mike, you got it, son. Oh, yes, I'm the great pretender. Pretending that I'm doing well My need is such I pretend too much I'm lonely but no one can tell Oh yes, I'm the great pretender Adrift in a world all my own I play the game, but to my real shame, you've left me to dream all alone. And too real is this feeling of make-believe, and too real when I feel what my heart can't conceal. Oh, 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 yes, I'm the great. Pretender, just laughing and happy like a clown. I seem to be, but I'm not. You see, I'm just wearing my heart like a crown. Pretending that you're still around, and to real. Can't conceal. Oh, 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 yes, I'm the great pretender. Just laughing and happy like a clown. I seem to be, but I'm not. You see, I'm just wearing my heart like a crown. Pretending that you're still around, still around. Oh, well, if I knew all the words of that, I'd sing it myself. <laughs> it wouldn't sound near as good, but I'd sing it. Right now, we're going to pay another light bill for M&M Instant Package Delivery. James Smith, been in business around Memphis for a long time, 22 years. He's been he's been delivering small packages across Memphis and the Mid-South area for as long as I've been working for the old Bell Telephone Company, Tommy. And he does a good job at it. Did you get him fixed up the other day? Oh, boy, I tell you what, he called me and he told me I can't talk to nobody. And I went down there and I fixed the telephone for him. He can talk now. Well, I didn't fix him, but I had somebody fix him for him. You had a, you had a job yeah, done. That's, that that's what right. No, I'm not in a telephone fixing business. I'm in the truck driving business. I just drive around and tell somebody else to work. You either organize, deputize, and supervise. Me, that's right? the way it works, and that's what James does. He's been in business 22 years around Memphis with a large fleet of trucks and vans to deliver your package needs across Memphis in the Mid-South area. And while I was up there in his office, I heard him talking to one of his drivers down in Olive Branch. So he spreads out. Oh, yeah, he gets out. He spreads out and he does it. They're bonded. They're insured. They got courteous, safe drivers. They will take your small package across town in a hurry for you. They'll handle just about anything. They will handle anything that's legal, from microfilm, data processing material, bank deposits that are non-negotiable, 
They'll do plumbing supplies, electrical supplies. They'll haul nails. They'll go buy you a hammer and bring it to you. Whatever you need, M&M Instant Package Delivery will do it for you in a good manner and safely, and they'll do it fast for you. James Smith, he's the guy. The telephone number is 722-8118. It's 722-8118 for James Smith and M&M Instant Package Delivery. He's also the number one wrestler promoter, too. You know that? Yeah, you knew it, didn't you? I see Mike Strickland strapping on a guitar over there, so I guess Mike's going to do us a little song with the guitar. Mike, you got it, son. Well, I'm going to raise a fuss, I'm going to raise a holler. Just to try to earn a dollar Every time I call my girlfriend And try to get a date She says, a new guy's son Cause she didn't work a leap Sometimes I wonder What I'm gonna do Cause I ain't no cue For the summertime blues Son, you gotta earn some money If you wanna use a car to go riding next Sunday Well, I didn't go to work I told the boss I was sick He said, I'd like to help you, son But you didn't work a lick Sometimes I wonder what I'm gonna do Cause I ain't no cure for the summertime blues I'm going to send my problems to the United Nations. Well, I called up my congressman and he said, quote, I'd like to help you, son, but you're too young to vote. Sometimes I wonder what I'm going to do, because there ain't no cure for the summertime blues. Mike Strickland and his one-man orchestra. By God, he done a great job on that one. All right, you listen to live music from the world-famous Western Steakhouse and Lounge on Hot Country B95 out of Orlando Coldwater. We're here every Saturday night from 9.30 to 10.30, and my sidekick, J.C., is my number one engineer and my number one sidekick talker. What are you going to yeah, talk about, Yeah, we own the Leo Thompson now. We're up here, Tommy. That's what we are. Well, 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 why don't you do a commercial while you're on there for uh, somebody? Ooh. Oh, my God. How about Don Couch and Southern Maintenance Company? I know his name right off the bat. All right. Let's, Don Couch is a man to see if you at, want something done. Isn't at it? Southern Maintenance Company, the finest maintenance company in Memphis area. Over 50 years of experience in maintaining commercial, industrial, and residential property. Don Couch will do anything from building a conveyor belt for Twinkies, to paving a parking lot and painting lines on it. Southern Maintenance Company can do it. There's no job that's too big. There's no job that's too small. They handle them all. They'll give you a good price, the finest workmanship, the best materials available, and you won't believe the price. Just give them a chance. Don Couch, Southern Maintenance Company. You need to give them a call if you've got something for them to do because they're ready, they're willing, and they're able. And that's what Don told me. They're 946-5513. It's 946-5513. And when you give him a call now, tell him you heard about it on V95 from the Western Steakhouse and Lounge, so he'll keep sponsoring the show. That's, you know, that's what makes it work. Yeah, that's what, hey, he got to pay the light bills, I, I tell you. I tell you, and the gas and the... And speaking of the light bills, we're going to be closed Sunday and Monday over the holidays. So don't drive up here or try to come in because we will be gone somewhere. We're going to lock the doors and turn off the lights. And we're going to do a little sewer cleaning back here. I yeah. know what we're going to do. Something. 
Tuesday we'll be wide open serving lunch. Boy, if you hadn't never eat lunch down here, you ought to try it because Miss Lil will put a feed bag on you that'll fill you up, I guarantee it. All right, we play loving hurting, cheating flirting, drinking lying, laughing crying songs, and right now, here's Mike Strickland to play one of them. Mike? All right, I'm going to... We got the president of Podunk Records out here, and uh, this is a song that's going to be on an album I got coming out. I'm going to especially dedicate this to my wife, to my son, Todd, my son, Ian, and a special uh, request for my daughter, Rachel. This is a song I wrote called Hush Little Boy. It's coming out on a 45. Go buy the album. 45. Hush, little boy, don't you cry again Hush, little boy, it's time to sleep again Mama's very tired You've had her on the run And I've been making music for your son I love you, boy I just want you to know I love your smile It's fun to watch you grow Close your eyes and dream there's no need to weep I'll stay and sing you gently off to sleep I know God is watching over you He gives you strength to start each day brand new He knows all your wants he knows all your demands, and I know you are safe within his hand. So hush, little boy, don't you cry again. Hush, little boy, it's time to sleep again. Mama's very tired, you've had her on the run. And I've been making music for your son So close your eyes and dream There's no need to weep I'll stay and sing you gently off to sleep Mike Strickland on V95 Radio from the Western State House and Lounge. Thanks, J.C. I see Tony's got somebody cornered down there. Tony Drees, where were you at last night? Where were you at? <laughs> That's the next question, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're going to get into this, are we? Uh, we're not going to tell him. We're not going to tell him nothing. <laughs> oh, Sheriff Department's had it again. Yeah, you might better leave that snake alone. It's liable to bite somebody. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tony Drees. He is a man of the hour tonight. We're going to, He's going to have a barbecue for the sheriff the 5th of June. Where's it going to be at, Tony? The Cage of Wrench, wherever that is. June the 5th, all right. Whatever. The sheriff's going to have a big barbecue. We've got tickets on sale over there if you all want to go. <laughs> oh, well, I'll get too many helps. I, I don't need no help because I can't hear it. All right, J.C., what do you got lined up for? Hey, hey, man, I don't know. Let's let Mike sing because I can't talk very long with it. He sings longer than I can talk, I guarantee you, and better, too. All right, Mike, lay it on us. Hear it up, son. All right. Besides uh, April 1954, mm -hmm. I was born. But this is the first rock and roll wife, anyway. Okay. I tell it to get out where I want, but it's all right. I, I'll listen to you again sometime. You know, uh, one thing about this radio show, in case you don't know it, we get a lot of listeners and a lot of calls, but they don't call while we're on the air for some reason. They always call later. 
But, you know, we really can't get a phone call on the air. It's hard to do. Well, I know why they don't call Huawei on the air, Tommy. Why? Because they're sitting there so intent <laughs> on trying to listen to me mess up on the radio that they don't have time to call. That's what it is. All right. Okay. All right. Live on B95 Hot Country Radio, here's Mike Strickland. Mike, you got it. Don't want you love. Strickland on V95 Radio from the Western Steakhouse and Lounge. You know something, Tommy? Right now we need to talk about a friend of ours. Talk. We got two friends. Talk. One of them, Billy Parrish. Talk. <laughs> He's down at Coleman Taylor Transmission at 466 Union Avenue. And you talk about a friend. He is one. He's the guy that can fix any transmission in this world. Matter of fact, He's got enough transmissions down there. He could just about change out the transmission in every car in Memphis. The largest stock of rebuilt transmissions anywhere in the Mid-South, and that's where it's at. It's at Coleman Taylor at 466 Union Avenue. Billy Parrish, he's a good friend of ours. He's a real fine fella. He'll put your car on what he calls his diagnostic machine. He'll tell you what's the matter with it, how much it's going to cost to get it fixed, when you can come get it, you come back when he says, you bring the amount of money he said, and your car will be fixed. And you can't ask for no more than that. man told me that he came back and he charged him less. Well, sometimes he'll do that. If, you know, if he makes a mistake and he tells you it's going to cost you 150 and all he had to do was take a five-foot screwdriver and adjust it, he will not charge you that much. But Billy Parrish... A Coleman Taylor transmission will do you right every time, I guarantee it. He's a close personal friend. He's an honest businessman. He's located at 466 Union Avenue. When you walk in the shop, tell him you heard about it on V95 Radio. He'll pat you on the back and do you even better, I guarantee it. All right, Billy Parrish, Coleman Taylor transmission. Right now, I want to say hi to Eddie Bond. I know he's listening. I know he's feeling better. I don't know if Eddie knows that uh, Ben Collins is in the hospital. He had a heart attack. He had four bypasses. I heard he was doing fair, but I don't know how he, what he's doing. I it's hard to find out anything about that hospital. You call up there and they're not here. Nobody's going to tell you nothing. You know that? you got to know a nurse that works up there. You don't get any information. Look at the flame coming out of that state going through there. Holy smackles. That's a sizzling, popping thing, isn't it? I didn't mean to rough you, but that steak took me by surprise. Just smell that thing. 
Oh, I think they can smell that on the radio. Think you can? Oh, well, if they do, it'll be black and white because we don't broadcast in color. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, live on B95, Hot Country Radio from the world-famous Western Steakhouse and Lounge. And on a guitar and vocals, Mike Strickland. Mike, you got it, son. All right, this is the flip, flip side to the other side over there. Heating and air conditioning company. If you're hot in the summertime, cold in the wintertime, Ross is the boy you need to talk to. Located down on Frisco Avenue, right here in Memphis, Tennessee, with us. The finest air conditioning, heating, and refrigeration company that you could possibly do business with. 
He does all of our air conditioning work up here, doesn't he, Tommy? We've been around a long time, and so is he. 30 years. Yeah, we got an air conditioner out there that's uh, just by as old as I am. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, he put that air conditioner in here back in 1963. How long ago was that? Well, that's, yeah, that's been about 26 years ago. That's a long time ago. It's still working. I can still feel it cooling. Yes, cooling. Yeah. That's the kind of work he does. He guarantees his work, and he does good work, and the Western Steakhouse and Lounge will testify to it. So if you need some heating and air conditioning work done or refrigeration work, he handles all of it. Give old Raw Smith a call. American Refrigeration, Heating, and Air Conditioning Company. And if you can't find him in the phone book, call right. T. Tommy down here at the lounge. Oh, uh, you look under A. He starts with American Heating, and he, he's there. I guarantee. That's right in the front of the book. It ain't hard uh, to I hear. guarantee you that part. Glenda, on your way down, would you bring me back up a Coke, please? Coke and uh, Cola. Coca Cola. Absolutely. You know, speaking of Coca Cola, Billy Lynn hasn't called us for a long time out. He lives out there and, uh, well, I, I, I tell you, Tommy, Billy's getting old and he starts getting to where he goes to sleep real early at night, you know. Well, he's starting to get on the patio again, but you know, he's Coca Cola man. And he's out there in, uh, Olive Branch where the Shrine Club is where, where you rode goats last summer. Yeah. <laughs> About a year ago, come July. Well, I tell you what, that was my last goat roping experience and uh You were wrestling goats too. Well, I like I like I love the Shriners. They're some of the best people I ever met in my life. And we had a good time in Olive Branch and uh I hope they raised a lot of money. I know we tried to help them. Yeah, they will again this year for the crippled so, children. Well they might do it, but they will not Get me to bring goats down there. I might bring a Shetland pony, but I ain't bringing Well, let goats. me tell you something. Uh, Jerome Litt sold his ranch down there, so I don't know where we're going to get no goats no more. Well, that's good. I don't need any. You don't goats. have to have no more goats. <laughs> I'm through. I'm through with them. We All right, on the Lil Thompson Hour, Colonel Lil Thompson Hour, live on Hot Country Radio from the Western Steakhouse and Lounge. Here is the one and only Mike Strickland. Mike, lay it on us. Standing on a mountain looking down at the city The way I feel is a doggone pity Teardrops falling down the mountainside Many times I've been here and many times I cried We used to be so happy when we made love High on the mountain of love Night after night I've been standing here alone Weeping my heart out till the cold bed dawn Hoping you're lonely and you'll come here too Hoping just by chance that I'll get a glimpse of you Trying hard to find you somewhere up above High on the mountain of love The mountain of love, the mountain of love You should be ashamed You used to be a mountain of love But you should change your name Way down below there's a half a million people Somewhere there's a church with a big tall steeple Inside the church there's an altar full of flowers the Wedding bells are ringing and they should have been hours That's why I'm so lonely here up above High on the mountain of love The mountain of love, the mountain of love You should be ashamed You used to be a mountain of love But you should change your name A million people Somewhere there's a church With a big tall steeple Inside the church There's an altar filled with flowers Wedding bells are ringing And there should have been hours That's why I'm so lonely Here up above High on the mountain of love High on the mountain of love High on the mountain of love Alright It's been a long time Since I heard that song Hasn't it? That's oldie but goodie. Is that what they call it? Oldie but goodie. Lil Thompson Hour. Colonel Lil Thompson Hour. Governor McWhorter made her a colonel the other day. They you one too, didn't they, J.C.? You a colonel too? I answer me. Yeah, but I don't outrank Lil. I'm just a lieutenant colonel. She's a full colonel. Oh, uh, you smart. You, you know what? 
Your wife has got you trained. I'll tell you that. Sure. I know what. I know which side of the butter my bread's on. <laughs> my bread is your butter, on, huh? Did you wake up grouchy this morning, J.C.? No, I didn't, Tommy. I got out of bed and I let her sleep till about seven thirty, eight o'clock. <laughs> Let's talk about uh, Mr. Owens, Rambo. Rambo Jack Owens and his what? What you going to talk about? Well, here? he's having his third annual birthday barbecue Monday, June the fifth of nineteen eighty nine, five p.m. until you get ready to go home at the Lucchese Ranch in Eads, Tennessee. It's fifty dollars per family. Now, if you got twenty five kids, it only costs you fifty bucks. That's you know this. It's no and it's a deal. donation to the drug fund, too. All right. We've got directions on the back side, but I haven't got my glasses on. But well, I guarantee, you can't read anyhow. I guarantee you it's in Eads, Tennessee, and if you get close to Eads, you go real fast. One of them sheriff deputies will tell you how to get there. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> Tony will have a, a bunch of them out there. Tell you. By the way, Tony's doing the barbecuing. Yeah, well, Don Couch built a barbecue for him, too. Tony, did you ever get your bell? That son of a gun. He's a lying rugger rugger. Rugger booger. I'm glad you said that. Rugger booger. <laughs> we won't name him, but we'll get him. Next time he goes to jail, <laughs> let him stay in there. That's the way to do that. That'll be doing. <laughs> anyway, this is the third annual birthday barbecue for Jack Owens. June the 5th, 5 p.m. until uh, you get ready to go home in East Tennessee. Y'all come. We'll all be there. The Western Steakhouse and Lounge will be well represented. Yeah, and I believe, are they going to broadcast live on the radio from there, Tony? Yeah, I think they're going to broadcast live on V95 on there, too. I always wanted to be live on the radio. Well, Lord, I thought you were about half dead tonight anyway. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> Oh, let's let Mike sing. He can sing better than we talk. I know. He sings better than we talk. Got time for a couple more songs from Mike. So, Mike, get us into one. This song called Sweet Everlasting Love, also on the Podunk label. <laughs> Once in a while It stays once in a lifetime The nights are passing by And we must choose the right time takes a special kind Hearts weren't made to play with And I've made up my mind It shows I'll be wanting to stay with Takes a long time to know it. 
all about love, sweet everlasting love. And baby, you show it, sweet love. Baby, you show it. Talking about your sweet, your sweet everlasting love. Mike Strickland live on B95. Thanks, folks. Right now, I would like to introduce one of Sheriff Jack's open. Chief of Staff Deputy Mike Strickland's going to close us out. Yes, yeah, say good night, y'all. I Mike say saw the harbor light. They only told me we were parting. Those same old harbor lights that once brought you to me. I watched the harbor lights. How could I help if tears were starting? Goodbye to tender nights beside the silvery sea. I long to hold you dear. And kiss you just once more. But you were on the ship, and I was on the shore. Now I know lonely nights for all the while my heart is whispering some other harbor light will steal your love from me I long to hold you dear yes and kiss you just once more but you were on the ship, and I was on the shore. Now I know lonely nights, for all the while my heart is whispering. Some other harbor lights. We'll steal your love from me. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh we Turn off the harbor lights. It's just about time for us to get out of here. Matter of fact, it is, Tommy. It's time to well, end. Well, thank all our sponsors, JC. I'm going to do that. We're going to say thank you to George Taggett and Cowboy Corner. Don Couch with Southern Maintenance Company, Ross Smith, American Heating and Refrigeration and Air Conditioning Company, James Smith, and M&M Instant Package Delivery, and Coleman Taylor with Billy Parrish, I guarantee you. And also, a great big howdy to old Buddy Weber with Central Electrical Contractors. He does our electrical work around here. The 220, the 440, and the 880, and everything else that books up. We'd like to remind you that you've been listening to a live broadcast in the Western Steakhouse and Lounge at 1298 Madison Avenue on WVIM Radio FM 95 from Hernando, Hot Coldwater. Country Radio. It's hot as a rascal, I guarantee you. We'll be back next week at 9.30 to 10.30. Absolutely. And we want to thank Mike Strickland tonight. And if you want to listen to him later in the night, Mike is playing out at the... Uh, 
September Club later, I believe. Let's give them a plug, too, all right? Yeah, that's right down there close to the radio station. I'll yeah, it's you that are. down the way down. I'm huh? skipping a jump. Just drive over and listen. All right, good night. God bless. And thank you all for listening. Play us out here, Mike. Here's my theme song. Well, I'm sitting in my rocking chair, rocking all day long. Mama knits the clothes I wear while I just sing my songs. Mama's in the kitchen cooking things for supper. She does all the housework. And maybe that's the reason I love her one of these days when I feel like I can. I'll get up off my lazy tail and lend a helping hand. But for right now, I don't see how, cause I got no energy. And as long as she will do it, that's the way it's gonna be.